They Just Is Brewing is a brewery here in the Aurora Cultural Arts District. Uh, this is the Big Gay IPA. We first released this in April of 2021. Uh, Calissa, who is the owner and head brewer of Gold Spot Brewing, uh, she and I are two of the only queer brewers, brewery owners in the country, and we both happen to live here. We uh, founded in 2015, and then last year, two years ago, March of 2020, three days before COVID, we moved into this spot. Max production in here is about 42 barrels at any, any given time. Um, we're a philanthropic brewery. We donate 100% of our profits over the cost from the sales of our beer memberships out the door to Colorado nonprofits that work with women and girls. It hasn't been easy at all. Um, you know, any business plan or any planning that you were doing in January, February of 2020 immediately went out the window. So people have had to be creative and had to be, um, had to persevere through a lot of stuff. I think in January and February, 2021, pivoting looked more like waiting for more government mandates, seeing what um, leaders in our community were gonna tell us to do and just sort of bracing for whatever was gonna come. Uh, pivoting January, February of 2022. Um, it feels like <laughs> less of a, pig, a pivot and more of just like a treading water and just trying to um, trying to be as creative as possible, trying to stay as steady as possible in what's going on and just keep keep pushing, keep moving. And so we decided as a group to take down bar seating. So we had bar seating up all the way until last uh, last week. And then we decided to just close off every other table to help distance um, folks when they're sitting down. And we've also been requiring masks this whole time. So we're keeping masks going. Um, so with all the bar seating gone and with spacing out tables, we're really operating at about 50% capacity right now. I assumed that masks were gonna be a part of our everyday life probably for a while. I was not expecting this sort of spike in cases. And of course, I don't think anybody could have expected Omicron to come away, you know, come in the way that it did. Uh, so yeah, so I was expecting COVID to still be around, but maybe not be as extreme as it is right now. Yo, it's terribly frustrating uh, to have to be um, always sort of navigating what's going on and trying to figure out what's coming next. Um, from a business standpoint, Nothing's predictable anymore, so it's really hard to plan for the future. It's really hard to um, really have a good idea of what revenue is gonna look like even week to week. So uh, it's frustrating, it's exhausting. Um, definitely not a space I don't think anybody would ever volunteer to be in. 